And welcome back folks, welcome back to Let's Play Fallout. When we last left off, we had just spoken to Raslo, the doctor here, who has been giving us important information about the red scorpions, namely we learned that they are sensitive to light. So when we have to face them, it's probably a good idea to have a lot of these um, flares ready. And we stole his doctor's bag, which I think um, we actually can't use. We could try to trade it back to him, that would be funny. Let us try to trade, <laughs> let us just try to trade the bag back to him. But let's first talk about some people. Okay, again, um, no one seems to know Ian. Hmm. Okay. Can I sell you back your doctor's bag? How about you give me these, uh, these? <laughs> I, I just traded him back his doctor's bag. Okay. That's just hilarious. Um, I, I, I mean, I don't think I. We actually need this doctor's bag. I hope this hadn't been a mistake. Okay. Anyway. Uh, let us see. We have now 106 bottle caps. We we can actually now hire Ian. But first, before we do that, we shall have a look around. This village. And there's a library where I can steal books. Yeah, last time we found a book about medical skills. So let us check our characters. We have a skill of 1% in Outdoors Man, which is not really fantastic. Let us see how much this improves when we have re read this book. And watch the book magically disappear as it, it is being read away. You learn. And then the text called Ray. Okay, anyway, uh, yeah, we've learned a lot about outdoor skills. We have learned nine points in Outdoors Man, which, which is quite good. You know, we are still not very fantastic at this skill. Um, let us see whether. Yeah, let us explore the rest of this village. So there's the second part over there. Hello. Hello, Wanderer. I trade and sell goods to the fine people of Shady Sands. Would you like to see my wares? Uh, yes. Do you sell ropes? No. But you sell knives, uh, spears, hammers, Police baton and crowbars. Okay. Uh, and another survival book. Okay, can I? I'm not really interested in any of your stuff, except maybe for this police baton. Well, I could sell the knife. Hmm. Let, let us see what you can say. What do you know about Ian? Yeah, this is just the same generic answer. Okay, I'm not... Yeah, I don't want to barter with you. Yeah, he's his personal guard. Quite obviously. Uh, And the kids in this community all seem to be a bit radiated, or just happy. Um. Hmm. Can I talk to you? Not really. Okay. What's the deal with this place? We are a two community. We all work and share together. How do you survive out here? 
we farmed and irrigation, and we heard Bach mean. Everybody contributes their skills to making something useful. Who's your leader? Our dash is our leader, Kurt Elder. With his experience, he helps to lead the community. Uh, can you? Uh, do we have anything good? Okay, you have bottle caps. But I don't have anything to trade them for. Uh, so goodbye. Let us steal some of some of their stuff. Another survival book and a rope. Yes, that's what we needed. We definitely need this rope. In order to get to vault or to explore vault 15. So we now we are on 10 points in Autos Man. Let us read another book and then magically get better at scouting. We learn a lot about wilderness survival techniques. And now we are on 19 points in Autos Man. So every book apparently gives you 9 points in. Every survival handbook gives you 9 points in Autos, Autos Man. As much as you try, you cannot think of a way to move of moving this vault, this well to your vault. You see the water supply of sh to Shady Sands. This is too little water to supply your vault. Yeah, obviously. Hmm. Welcome to Shady Sands, stranger. So just the same dialogue option, but maybe she trades something. Yeah, only the same generic 12 bottle caps. We have enough bottle caps right now. Um, at least for the purpose of hiring Ian. It looks like a mutated cabbage to you. It seems to be thriving in the warm weather. A mutated corn stock, it seems to be thriving under these conditions. You see nothing out of the ordinary. Let us talk to him. What can I do you for? What's your name? I'm called Curtis. Can you tell me about your village? Our village is small, but we support ourselves. Aside from the attacks by raiders and the occasional rot sco red scorpion, we have no problems. Our dish is a good leader. What are you doing? I'm a farmer. We irrigated the desert many years ago. Although the wasteland by the way, this is a reference to the predecessor of this, the spiritual predecessor of Fallout. Although the wasteland is harsh, it is possible to grow things with patience and time. I see, you seem to be doing pretty well. Uh, do we have anything to trade for? Some irradiated, irradiated fruit. I don't, not particularly interested. Do we know anything about Ian? <laughs> okay, nobody seems to know Ian. Yeah, just the same generic answers. Okay, we've met Curtis. Curtis apparently. By the way, what do you know about Cornstalk? Why do you think I'd know anything about, about that? That's because you plant it. How about cabbage? Doesn't ring a bell, does it? Okay. Yeah, he doesn't know much about um, agriculture, apparently. No wonder your uh, field looks so desolate. Good day. Who said that? You said that. I got nothing to say to you, stranger. Okay, if that is so, then I shall leave. A nicely made table. Hand made, but it looks much nicer than any table you've seen before. Hmm. Is there anything special about this table? Hello. 
No, just a generic table. Let us leave. And I desperately hope <clears throat> that the game is recording. Recording the in-game audio. That is, okay. Let us hire Ian. Ah, they they now like us apparently. Can we talk to you? No. For some reason I can't talk to you now. Yeah, not such a bad person even though I stole all your stuff. Can you help me out a bit? Hmm, tempting author. Since this place gets boring, tell you what. Standard rates, 100 caps and you've got a deal. Deal. Let's go. It'll be good to get back into action. And now we have a companion. You can order your companion around. What weapons are you skilled with? I'm a good shot with just about any sort of pistol and I can use a submachine gun too. I also know how to handle a knife. Um, let's discuss our combat tactics. Draw your best weapon. Sure thing, bird. Okay, um... Get the fuck out of my way. No, no, no. Okay, barter. You can actually barter with him. Um, yeah, he, ha he has a knife, apparently. Um, so I don't want, need to give you anything right now. You could have this ammunition, in case you need it, later. But right now... Uh, I don't need to change anything. Yeah, in Fallout 2, you actually don't have to use the bartering system in order to equip your companions. They changed that in the second game. Do you know Curtis? <laughs> is this a joke? I have no idea what that is. At least, um, yeah, that's apparently Ian's revenge on those people that don't seem to know him. I mean, how come they don't know him? They should, really. Okay, let us... Okay, I can't see Tandy right anywhere. Let us, before we head out, just for the fun of it. Ah, oh, there's Tandy. No, that's not Tandy, okay. Greetings. What may I help you with this fine day? Uh, can, oh, sorry. Just hit my microphone there. Sorry, sorry. How about... I can't really say I have heard of that. Yeah. It's a person. Our dash, it is one of your people. Goodbye. It's not a thing. If you are the village elder, how come you have never heard of it? Maybe you're not such a great... A village elder than after all. Okay, let us leave. Before we shall leave, we shall save. Uh, yeah, this should be LP number six. Okay, let us leave. Um, before, so let us. Um, head to Vault 15. After all, our quest is to find a water purification ship. And our best um, guess right now is to search at Vault 15. But this will have to wait until next time. So when we come back, folks, we'll go to Vault 15 and yeah, see what we'll find there. So until next time, folks, until then.